Hi guys, so let's start coding what we actually saw on the problems, okay? So we knew that we have an initial balance of uh, 10,000 pesos, and there we go. Um, and we have a goal of uh, 15,000 pesos, okay? And we know that we have an interest rate of 5%, okay? Which I'm gonna write in percentage, which would be 0.05, okay? So now we know we want to uh, move and uh, start working uh, from 10,000 until uh, we, from here, we start from here until we get to here, right? So this, we need to do a transition from here to here, right? So um, what we know is that we have an interest rate of 5% and we need to do, keep doing this all over and over again, like a number of times until this happens. So how to do that? Um, we know that we need to use a while. So we need to say, okay, while my balance is smaller than my goal, I'm gonna do something. Don't forget your columns. And okay, now we need to start writing. Remember we need some indentation. Remember indentation is this little space that's uh, right there. Uh, let me just put some nice line in there. So here, here. This little space that we have over here, that's indentation. And we need it to, um, to leave it there so that Python knows that everything is inside the while, okay? So uh, I'm gonna say while um, this thing happens, oh, I need to know the number of years, right? It takes me. And so it's gonna start in zero, right? Um, so um, while, there, it looks nicer there <laughs> that way. So while my balance is more than the goal, I need to increment the number of years. Uh, it's years plus one. Okay. And actually you can rewrite this as uh, years equals plus one. Okay. These two lines are exactly the same. Are exactly the same, okay. I remember that, that's gonna make you happy. Uh, <laughs> okay, so uh, from that we need, to, we need, we know we need to increment the years and we need to increment our balance. So our balance, it's equal to, um, if you remember what we wrote on, the, on our previous screen, we needed to write that the, the new balance is equal to um, one times, uh, well, 1.05 times our original balance, right? That's the thing that is there, actually. Um, that was it. Um, so we need to actually do that. So how to write that in computer science code? So that's pretty much balance times um, 1.05. And that's pretty much it, okay? So this code, what it's gonna do, it's gonna start repeating itself like a number of times uh, until, so this thing is gonna repeat a long number of times until this happens, okay? So now let's print what's happening in here so that we know what uh, to expect. So let me print, oh, let me define some text before. Um, 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 year and current balance, right? Let me put it like out there so that it looks nicer. Um, here, so let me print um, txt dot format, and I'm gonna say uh, years comma, uh, balance, right? And uh, now what I'm gonna say is, um, at the end of it, I'm gonna say print, uh, now we have as much money as we want. Okay, and that's pretty much it. 
So let's run it and see if it works. Huh. There you go. Okay, so there we go. Oh, I screwed it. It was the other way around. My bad. <laughs> Sorry for that, guys. Uh, there you go. So now we know it took nine years to um, to get to our goal. I mean, it's here. Um, here, here. Um, so now from this part, we can see that it took us nine years to arrive to this point where we got like a number bigger than 15,000. Okay, so that's pretty much as a table we had and that deserves a near a real happy face. Okay, so this is the most simple way of doing repetitive um, stuff in, um, in a while loop, okay? We're gonna cover some more examples and I hope it just like is more clear each and every time.